all today i am starting a session um of a field status variant this is my first screen and i am going to second screen here spro enter then display SAP reference IMG and uh, we have a screen display IMG after after that I am going to financial accounting new then financial accounting global setting new then ledgers then fields then define field status variant execute it just processing now we have this screen <coughs> go to triple zero one <coughs> click on select the line select the row copy this and then write here our company code xyz1 fill status for xyz1 then again enter then copy all then continue then save it data was saved go back and we need to assign our company code uh, our, our field status variant in assign company code to field status variant Define field status variants T code is OBC4. I can show you where additional information, display key, and IMG activity. So, last four keys are most probably is T code OBC4 for field status variants. And now we assign our field status variant in assign company code to field status variant click execute button then go to position and search for our company code xyz1 enter then write it here what is my field status variant is xyz1 then save it data was saved now I am going for for the information purpose we go to document then go to document type then go to document define document and uh, type for entry view go to execute will be a7 for the information only we can see what we use for which purpose a for account uh, asset posting a b for accounting document a f for depreciation posting most probably we are uh, we can see k r for vendor invoice k z for vendor payment which is most probably we can see d for uh, <coughs> customer invoice dz for customer payment as for uh, gl account document so most probably these uh, we can see here we can we don't change this because uh, uh, it is already defaulted here and these all uh, document types are for information purpose only 
Now we go to document number ranges. How we go to document number ranges? I can show you the path, which is easy to understand. First, we go to display IMG, then go to financial accounting new, then financial accounting global setting new, then document, then go to document number ranges. In the document number ranges, we go to document in entry view, then do, uh, define document number ranges for entry view F B N one our T code. Go to execute. Now we have this screen company code X Y Z one which is my company code and go to pencil interval which is change intervals click here just processing Still it's showing as processing then go to insert interval and then go to insert interval uh, this is our insert interval create our insert interval uh, for example 01 year 2018 from 1 to 10,000 then go to insert then save it then enter then go back go back we can uh, copy uh, from SAP default company code so I am showing you how we copy this uh, go to copy to company code click on execute go to number ranges um zero one for multiple selection no. our <coughs> number ranges is uh, maximum x two and uh, com uh, SCP's default company code is triple zero one and target company code details is xyz1 which is my company code then go to execute then yes then uh, these are com these are created here all the details we can see here all are copy then we go to tolerance group in a document we can see here is a tolerance group and then go to define tolerance group for employees click on execute button we can execute by shortcut key shift plus tab then for enter we click on space 
गो टू न्यू एंट्रीज कंपनी कोड एक्स वाई जेड वन अमाउंट पर डॉक्यूमेंट आई कैन गिव दिस टेन करो ओके एंड हेयर आई गिव अमाउंट वन करो एंड कैश डिस्काउंट पर लाइन आइटम वी कैन गिव एनी परसेंटेज फॉर कैश डिस्काउंट आई एम गिविंग हेयर मैक्सिमम ट्वेंटी परसेंट दैन सेव इट नाउ वी हैव टू असाइन दिस बिकॉज वी डिफाइन हेयर सो हेयर असाइन यूजर टॉलरेंस ग्रुप Go to new entries. No, we don't need to assign here. It already assigned. O B A four. Then, uh, if you like my video, for uh, uh, field status variant and documents and tolerance group. For more videos, you like my video. and subscribe my channel for more videos and i'm showing you how to define posting keys too in this topic these are post these posting keys is for know about the entries which is already default by sap we don't change this and we don't create or we don't delete this we can see how our entries are going on for 30 uh for 31 for invoice posting debt to vendor credit to vendor most probably we are using 40 50 Forty for debit entry, credit fifty uh, for credit entry in GL account, and for customer we are using zero one debit and eleven for credit zero one zero one for invoice debit and eleven for credit memo. and when uh, for vendor we are using 21 credit memo and 31 for invoice credit vendor for asset we are using 70 for debit 75 for credit 70 for debit asset and 75 for credit asset these are for information purpose if you like my video please subscribe and click on bell button for more information thank you so much for watching my video